All right, so tame the croc, the new dino. Uh, it's probably best to use a trap. I don't necessarily have to, but I'm sure it's easier to use a trap and safer, a lot safer. Uh, and also, if you ever try to tame a dinosaur out of a trap, you know all the issues that can possibly happen. So, I mean, this is similar to a Giga Trap, right? You can use any style you want. I'm just going to use Dino Gates with a Bear Trap in it. That's the easiest uh, method. Okay, now that we have one, we need to bring it back to our trap here. Let's get it aggro. Come on. There it goes. All right. Not very. Come on, bud. You fall back to the trap. There we go. Oh, no! Wow. Okay, so they're really powerful. <laughs> okay, so as you saw, Teraton was way <laughs> too squishy for this. So we gotta try and get him the rest of the way to the trap. We could bait him with a uh, liver and we could even do like a uh, uh, pick up a, a, a dino and uh, aggro him with that like we do with Gigas. But um, he's already close enough to the trap from chasing the Teraton. I'm just gonna shoot him and get him into the trap, hopefully. I uh, hope that goes well. If not, at least I'll have his attention, right? Okay. Oh no, he went around behind the trap crate. <laughs> He's on the wrong side now. Okay, well at least we have his attention. Oh, oh, did he get—he went in the trap, almost. Oh, he got stuck. He got stuck. Get up on him. Should just need one here. You know what, just in case he can get out, I'm going to pop another one there, and there. Okay, he should be stuck now. Oh! No, no, don't buy the wyvern. Alright, now he's trapped. We need to bring some stuff to him. And it has to be something you can actually drag uh, with whatever weight you have. Oh, okay, cool. So, I can drag a trike. I have 500 weight, so let's drag a trike. All those owls are going here, messing everything up. Okay, so as I approach him, he'll start sniffing. On all this, so we know we're good. It's not gonna bite us. We brought him food. He should get interested and want to eat it now. I'll just drag the body and we'll get him to sniff again. Uh, maybe I'm holding on to the body too long. Maybe as soon as he, before he starts sniffing, he let go. Okay, let's get his attention. Okay, let go. Okay, so we set him free because he's not eating inside the trap, so they've already passed the trap out method. They don't like trapping him, so this one's just a glitch. And he doesn't care. <laughs> Chasing around with food, he doesn't care. Alright. Watch him kill me now, let him out. Oh, he ate my first tribute. Okay, so yeah, he needs to be out and free. Uh, we'll bring in the second one here. Release the body. And he'll eat it. I hope. Don't eat me. Don't eat me. Okay. And he ate it. And all right. Now we can. Now he's a free. Where is he going? Oh no. He's faster than me. Guess <laughs> I went for weight, so I can. Okay. So he's free. Okay. Now we can ride him. Our effectiveness is 100% right now. Okay. So let's start killing. Oh, so this guy's going to take a long time to tame. Alright, just depending on what you're feeding him. Oh! So there's a catch. If you take damage while fighting dinos so that he can eat and tame, you lose taming effectiveness. So it looks like you just want to eat a bunch of easy dinos because your effectiveness only seems to only go down so far when he eats. Well, we'll continue testing and figure that out. We'll also test and see which ones will give you the best uh, percentage. But you also have a timer on how quickly you have to eat stuff or you start losing percentage as well. Now, of course, this is just a quick video to get out so you can see how to tame them, so you can start taming them yourselves. Uh, I will be doing a video later. It will give you, you know, tell you exactly the best way to tame it, everything you need, uh, all that kind of stuff. I'm working on that. I just got off work. Um, life event has been going for a while now, but I had to work all day. So, yeah, so I'm trying to make these videos now and get them out to you. Uh, Tuesday will most likely be the video where I release how the best way to tame this guy. Uh, the best is favorite food, all of that. Looks like we have 173 seconds left to get this guy tamed before we're completely out of time. So we've got to eat stuff fast. This kind of reminds me of the uh, Amosagoras taming. It's not quite as bad, but it's, it's up there. <laughs> it's going to kind of be hard to do. Alright, let's find out what happens when you run out of time. Five, four, 
Three, two, one, zero. We're no longer friends. Is he gonna eat me now? Probably. <laughs> okay, so it seems traps work for some people and not others. You may have already patched it out, so you may not be able to use the trap on this. You're gonna want to be able to find dinos close to them that you can drag, pick them with a dragon or a quetzal or whatever, and bring them closer, and then kill them and drag them to them. However you want to do it. All right, so we brought it trike over here and we're gonna just drag him to the uh drag him over here let's make friends with him again uh, if you're having a hard time dragging the body but you, you should have the weight to do it oh what you doing dragon <laughs> if you have the weight to do it then uh yeah just hit you just hit, hit tap g a bunch on the keyboard and then oh where do you go and you should be able to grab the body all right, like I can drag a track because I have 500 weight. I'm not sure exactly how much you need to drag a track, but these seem to work pretty good and bring them almost to full friendship here. All right, so you got to sneak up on them. All right, once you have a, once you're dragging a body, they don't seem to be too aggressive to you. So you start sniffing. It's like, oh, you bring me something to eat. Here we go. It's like, all right, you can be okay. Release this food to him. All right, and then see there, there we go, we're about halfway. We bring him one more of those. Oh, he got aggressive. Nope, I'm so dead. <laughs> so you might want to put some beds and sleeping rags around because this could happen. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. oh, let's see. So, all right, let's try this again. We already made friends with him once. Oh no, there we go. It's there. It just wasn't close enough. Oh wow, drained quite a bit though. It drains pretty quickly, so you want to make sure you have a multiple. Dino's nearby. Okay, he's sniffing it, smells it, and we're getting we've gotta get away out of here. Get far away from him so he doesn't aggro you. So let him eat it. Let's see what we get. How much do we get from it? Oh, almost filled them up. Alright, great. You see me anyway? No, okay. So now we'll go get another trike. I will do this again. Okay, here comes the tricky part. Now, when you make friends with him, he's gonna take off running and <laughs> go fight stuff. So you're going to want to hop on him as quickly as you can. All right, and you may have to chase him. You may need good movement speed for this. Uh, if you have him, you can block his image. Oh, he's sniffing it. Time to get away. He'll come eat it. We just need to get away from here. Uh, so he doesn't kill us. Oh, wait, he's not going to kill us, though, because he's even become our friend, right? So never mind. We know, sure, this is going to bring him to friendship. So we need to be ready to get on him. Get on him fast before he runs. There we go. And now we can start chopping stuff. Oh, and there we go, we've lost some of the taming effectiveness, but as you can see, we still have our taming percentage built up, so that's good. We still have uh, 587 seconds now to do this again. So yeah, you'll lose taming effectiveness if he kicks you off, or maybe, you know, he's meant to kick you off a few times. Uh, 570 seconds is not a lot of time, especially as little as we're getting. So the lower level one of these is, of course, the easier this part's going to be. So depending on the area you're in and how many dinos there are to eat, all that kind of stuff, what kind of dinos there are, um, you may need to, may end up be getting kicked off of them a few times uh, and just having to refriend them and get back on and continue your taming where from where it was at uh, and just keep building up. So far we're at 50% and we're we'll just going up from here. I will be making another video to show you what the best, uh, the best way to tame these guys are, what the best dinos are, the best methods, things like that. This is just a quick video to get you started, help you figure out how to tame it. One thing to note when taming these guys, don't let them run out of stamina. If they run out of stamina, they can't keep biting like a giga. Um, so you gotta watch for that. Alright, and that's pretty much all there is to taming them for the basics anyway, right? So we went over the basics, how to tame them. And yeah, that's pretty much it. You just rinse, repeat until you get it tamed. And be careful. <laughs> Please sleep bags, beds around. Uh, you're probably gonna die a few times doing this. Yeah. So if the trap's not working for you, wild car may not want you trapping them. Um, I imagine they would patch that. They'll patch that out pretty quickly if they're already patched it out. Usually with these passive new tames, they don't like you trapping. Them. So uh, well, it seems like it's already patched out, but maybe that was just a fluke. Uh, but anyway, if it's not working in the trap, you don't necessarily need one. You can do it outside the trap. You're going to have to let it out of the trap anyway. And then you're going to have to keep rinse and repeat a few times, especially if it's high level. All right, and of course, we'll figure out how to tame it better and faster in a future video. So make sure you like and subscribe. Yeah, y'all have an awesome day.